Camino Portuguese, day two diary. It's actually the morning of day three. I'm here at my little breakfast spot. I've been hiking just under three hours, gone around 13K. I'm in a smaller town called Volada, really pretty. Uh, right along the water here, there's some gorgeous architecture in the buildings. And most of this morning, I was walking through fields and seeing farmers hard at work and, you know, just having an overall immense sense of gratitude for farmers and everything they do for us. You know, they work so hard for all of us to live. Without farmers, uh, none of us would be alive. So uh, I just went to a little shop here and I got some tarts, pastel de nata. I've been surviving on these in the morning. They're so good. They're a little bit sweet, but not crazy sweet. And I'm uh, gonna sit here, have a nice little break. And this is my pack. I've got my shoes on the outside. I've got some socks just drying on the side. I'm actually hiking right now in my yoga sandals. Doing my best to hike as much as I can in my sandals when it's flat and paved. It's uh, with these sandals, it's just nice letting the feet breathe. And it's nice, uh, of course, let my feet air out. So once again, I really thank you for following me along. And uh, I look forward to having a wonderful day here. So um, today I basically had the option of hiking to this town to stay for the night or to another town. And I'm deciding to hike to the other town called Santaram. So I've got about 20k to go. Um, but I just want my, I feel okay. I don't have any blisters. I'm a little sore and that is okay. Take care and be well.